Welcome to MyPatchLink.com's video series on allergic contact dermatitis. In the short video you are about to watch, you will learn about your allergy and where to go for additional information. Hello, my name is Dr. Kurt Hammond and I am going to speak to you today about your patch test results. Your results indicate that you have a contact allergy to nickel, a common metal. If you haven't already, I suggest watching the video titled Allergic Contact Dermatitis. Having allergic contact dermatitis simply means that your immune system has developed a memory to a particular substance and may react whenever your skin comes in contact with it. In your case, because of your allergy to nickel, your skin may react if it comes in contact with a product that contains nickel. This contact allergy may cause your skin to react when exposed to nickel although it may take several days for the symptoms to appear after a metal object that contains nickel touches your skin. Typical symptoms may include redness, swelling, and itching. Some patients may experience fluid-filled blisters. What is this substance? Nickel may be found in any metal product. It is impossible to tell if a metal product releases nickel just by looking at it. Nickel is commonly found in jewelry, especially earrings, as well as watches and watch bands. It is often found in buttons, snaps, and zippers, as well as in products you use around the home like scissors and cooking utensils. However, nickel containing dental restorations, orthodontic braces, and artificial joints have rarely been reported to cause problems in patients allergic to nickel. Additionally, nickel may also be found in foods such as beans, fish, potatoes, and even chocolate. How do you avoid it? Jewelry that is made from aluminum, yellow gold, sterling silver, and platinum is generally safe. Items made from stainless steel or surgical steel usually contain nickel, but do not release it and are generally safe to wear. If your nickel allergy causes a rash on your hands, use nickel-free or stainless steel scissors and utensils and plastic combs or use items with plastic or wood handles. Also consider covering nickel containing items such as keys and doorknobs. Some items can be coated with a polyurethane lacquer or clear nail polish. If you are not sure an item contains nickel, it is often useful to get a nickel detection kit such as the one I have here. Following the instructions, you will put a drop of the solution on a Q-tip and then rub the Q-tip on the metal item. If the Q-tip releases nickel, the Q-tip turns pink. And don't worry, the test does not damage or mark the item. Nickel allergies can be worse in hotter times of the year. Friction and pressure, combined with the presence of perspiration, can cause your skin to react more readily or make your symptoms worse. You may also react to other metal substances that are present together with nickel, such as palladium, chrome or chromate, and cobalt. Although you have been diagnosed with a contact allergy to nickel, it is important to remember that it is manageable. Thank you, and I wish you success in managing your allergy. As with all medical conditions, if you believe you are suffering from allergic contact dermatitis, please contact your healthcare provider. Additional resources and information are available to you at mypatchlink.com resources.